Hey there, Hawks fans. We've got a fantastic new show for you. It's called Hawks Matchmaker. It involves taking two passionate Hawks fans, setting them up on a blind date. These blind dates will take place at one of our games during the season. Now, the first blind date of the year was actually at our game against Melbourne, which happened to be my 200th. Let's flick out there now and introduce you to the two blind daters. Forrest Bagel, 33, nearly 34. Uh, Asha, I'm 25. Four months? He never really had a solid boyfriend, so yeah. <laughs> oh, just a good day out, uh, watching footy, have a laugh. If it's a like-minded Hawks fan, we'll probably have a good time. Just have a bit of fun and yeah, hopefully find someone that has some mutual likes. Let's throw out there now and see how it's going. Hi, how are you going on Boris? Good, nice to meet you. hi, I'm Asha. Mwah. Nice to meet you. Take the seat, they made it nice and comfy for oh, us. Oh, nice. <laughs> how are you? Oh, pretty good, how are you going? Yeah, not too bad. Hope, hoping for a win today or what? Hopefully, hopefully a good win. Hopefully it's a smashing win. Yes, <laughs> get that uh, percentage off. That's exactly it. <laughs> so what we've, been, what we've been lacking over the last 10 weeks or so? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Interesting sort of so meeting. Yeah. <laughs> My parents are actually like sitting over there. They're here. Whoa, <laughs> oh, better be on mother's behavior. There was something else in this bag. It looks like a rug. Do you want oh, me really? to put a rug over you in case you get cold? Sure, why not? <laughs> Boris with the classic, do you want me to throw the rug over? Thank God he got a yes. Oh, wow. This game is starting well. <laughs> Alright, heads up. And you. Go. Awesome. <laughs> nice and warm. <laughs> At least our legs won't get yeah, that's true. wet if it does rain. <laughs> Who did you say was your favourite player when you're not in Luke Boyce. How about you? Gibson. You're going to seal the deal if I'm your favourite player, mate. But it's not my favourite, I just, they're like, you know what I mean, like, obviously it's always hard. Yeah, exactly, not, not for the, exactly. It's, it's almost like, yeah, look, if you go... Boris, what are you doing? You went with Gibson, you were winning. You've gone cold. Let's see, if, Gun if Gunson slots this one, it's going to be a big winner, right? He's lining up for it. Wait for it. Wait. And... Oh, he hit the post. Oh, my prediction's gone down to 20 points. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> I never actually asked how old are you? 25. What's your name? Asha. <laughs> I, I, didn't, I didn't say anything. How old are you? Um, 34 next month. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Yes! <laughs> Second time around. Let's go now to my good mate Shura, who interviewed the hot couple at half time to see how it's all progressing. Is Boris the sort of guy you could see yourself dating? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Boris, you seem to be the talkative one of the two. How do you think it's going? Yeah, it's going well. Well, you never know here. We might have just formed a little beautiful bond between two Hawthorne supporters here. What's going to happen for the rest of the day? Hopefully we get the win. And hopefully in two years' time, when you two have children, we'll come back and check in with you. Enjoy the day, Boris. Enjoy the day, Asha. It's all thanks to Iron Air, connecting people better. So what, what are you like, your favourite sort of weekend sort of activities? Um, no, anything really. Catch up with friends, whether it's coffee, dinner, breakfast. A bit um, of socialising, yeah. sharing some food and drinks, nice. Yeah. How about you, apart from football? Yeah, obviously, <laughs> I think footy's probably the main thing um, yeah. during the winter month. But like, because I'll go to games that don't involve my team either, because I'm an AFL member. Mm -hmm. But um, yeah, I do like I do heaps of like fitness type activities, mountain biking, um, I do boxing and, and just like all those sort of things. And then yeah. go to the movies, go out for drinks. I love finding new bars with like you know cool cocktails and good atmosphere and that. And yeah. What's that? I said I love watching the Oz kick. Did you do Oz kick when you were a kid? No. There's always the one though that's like off with the fairies or something, just like not concentrating on the game. Oh yeah, it's true. I remember there was at one time when we were sitting on the other side, there was one kid who was this really big meaty kid <laughs> and 
this some kid was like like trying to like get around him to kick the ball yeah. and the kid just stood there like this and the kid just smashed straight into him and so the guy with the ball fell over and the big meaty kids just like trying to pick up the ball it was so funny run on it oh get her get her yes Oh, I love the unison in the clapping, guys, and the high five to finish. Oh, so cute. Oh. Come on! Good job. Come on, Hawk, keep it up. What's the song? I think that would have been a, a hard game. Like, yeah, it's a it. tough slog. We're oh, a okay. happy thing. We're the mighty fighting horse. We love our club and we play to win. <laughs> Guys would be more um, shy about doing something like this, but yeah, guys, give it a crack. Well, there you have it. Our first blind date between Boris and Asher. I'd love to check back and see how the romance went between the two. Although I'm a little bit worried after Boris dropped that I wasn't his favourite player. I don't know how he's going to go finding love. But once again, thanks to Ironet for bringing us this fantastic show.